Israeli violence claimed the lives of 202 Palestinians so far in 2022 in occupied West Bank, Jerusalem, the Gaza Strip, and the 1948 occupied Palestinian lands. Welcome to Palestine in a minute. Start the clock. Israeli fans are not welcomed in the Qatar's World Cup 2022 as more Arab and international fans refuse to speak to Israeli activists and media channels over Israeli crimes against Palestinians. EU condemned Israel's demolition of a Palestinian primary school in Masafariyata, south of occupied Hebron. European Union delegation met with the family of a prisoner Ahmed Manasri after the Israeli court extended his security confinement. The EU calls for Israel to immediately release Manasri after the decision. Palestinian farmers in Gaza have started harvesting strawberries known as Gazas with gold from their lands and fields in Gaza Strip. Two Palestinians, Mohammed Gishik and Mohammed Hezbollah, were pronounced dead of their wounds sustained by Israeli forces in occupied Nablus. Israeli settlers set fire to several Palestinian-owned vehicles in Nablus and Jerusalem. Families of Palestinian victims whose bodies are withheld by Israeli authorities take part in a protest to demand Israel release the bodies of their sons killed by Israeli forces. Ultra-racist Israeli leader Itamar ben Gabir is set as Israel's new security minister, which constitutes clear evidence that Israeli elections are based on racism and extremism. That's all for today. Thanks for watching.